Hi, and welcome to ADECO at the Creekside Mushroom Farm, located in the quiet hills of Worthington, PA. It is here on Moonlight Drive that you will find some of the country's best tasting mushrooms that are grown with the most care and sophistication available. By joining the ADECO team at Creekside Mushrooms, you are not only taking the first step to a successful and profitable career, but you are joining a very specific and unique group of people that all have one thing in common, that is working for one of the country's most unique farms. Renowned as the world's largest fully integrated single-site mushroom growing facility, it is also the only underground mushroom farm in the United States. This farm sits on 2,036 acres above ground with over 150 miles of abandoned limestone tunnels, 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 tunnels. So it is a little bit past eight. Starting the clock. It's hard to describe just how quiet it is inside of a mine. A cave has life. A cave, the life is given through flowing water. It's a dangerous place, but not inhospitable. We spent much of our early years inside caves, but a mine? Just a dark, soulless void. Not a sound. alone? Well, you better be comfortable in your own skin. It doesn't take much to lose your head down here. Oxygen's nominal. No sign of explosive gases or anything, which is what I expected, what I hoped. on because I am trying to I'm confirming the map and I'm trying to see what I have access to right now right here we got a little what looks like a fire pit these are all dynamite boxes blasting cap boxes in there See, here they are. Not much left of them. We go forward. Every ADECO associate that works in the harvesting department at Creekside Mushrooms is required to use the same safety equipment and work tools. 
Each morning, you will be responsible for cleaning and testing all of your equipment before descending into the harvesting rooms. Be sure that you have a strong working battery for your light and that the light is in good working order. Remember, it is dark in the harvesting rooms and this light is an important tool to doing your job correctly. So this is another major problem. Got a small stream running down this main line here. And this orange color is rust. The iron leached into the water, which is, I believe it gets very acidic, and then it precipitates out, and leaves you with this orange gunk. The only problem is, this mush, this sludge, it can go pretty deep, it's hard to know where to walk. go down. Wooden timber holding up the ceiling. <laughs> I believe this mine is a hundred years old. I couldn't tell you when it closed. I would say pretty damn long time ago. Seems like every time I try to get to the main tunnels, another wall of rock. You can see the coal at the top of this one. That's handmade. Sleep, might just lay here. Try not to quit. <laughs> the terrain is rough. I know I'm just rambling, but I'm completely alone and cut off in here. No signal. This is a very lonely place. So just talking to the camera. It's Almost like, you know, you're not talking to yourself. I made it all the way down the main shaft there. And it kind of turned, and then I'm not sure all the tunnels that led to the modern, more active shaft are, are all caved in or filled in. So... Only thing you can really do is go deeper and maybe you find a path that isn't blocked. I don't know.
At the start of each day, you will meet with your assigned crew and descend into the harvesting area. Your crew leader will explain what areas you will be working in at the beginning of each shift. You might want to bring a warm shirt with you, as the harvesting rooms are a constant temperature between 60 and 62 degrees. Once you have reached your assigned harvesting room, your crew leader will guide you to what rows of trays are ready to be picked. Each row consists of an upper tray and a lower tray. Be sure to vary the trays that you are working on. This will help you to remain comfortable throughout your work day. Harvesting the mushrooms is where the money is at. All mushrooms are sorted by size and quality. Your crew leader will instruct you on the proper technique used to harvest the mushrooms. It may seem that at first you are picking very slow. Don't be discouraged. Every day your speed will increase. And remember, the more mushrooms you harvest each day, the more money you will make. Ask your Adeco associate about the production bonus. This bonus is made available to you from the first day as an Adeco associate at Creekside Mushrooms. After a nice long nap, it's now 9 a.m. Time on the clock is 13 hours. Gonna have some breakfast. And then get back to work.
Now that you have seen the procedures at Creekside Mushrooms, let's talk about some benefits of being an ADECO associate at Creekside. First, we have designated lunchrooms. Every person at Creekside Mushrooms can enjoy their lunch in a clean and comfortable environment. Vending machines are made available for your convenience. Next, we have access to the credit union. All ADECO associates at Creekside Mushrooms have full access to the on-site credit union. Details of the benefits can be found inside the credit union. And last, we have the production bonus. Every ADECO associate in the harvesting department is eligible to receive a production bonus based on the amount of produce that you harvest from your first day of employment. Some additional benefits to being an ADECO associate include 401k plan options, paid holidays, tuition reimbursement, health benefits, and direct deposit. Be sure to ask your ADECO associate for information on all of these great benefits. Working for ADECO at Creekside Mushrooms can be an extremely rewarding career. Not only will you be working for the world's largest employment network, but you'll be working for the most unique mushroom growing and packaging facility in the United States. The possibilities are endless. As you can see, ADECO truly does bring better work for a better life. We look forward to working with you and helping you grow and establish yourself with Creekside Mushrooms.
noon back in the main main tunnel 15 hours there you go so I really don't want to go back the way I came because it's spooky and it's really difficult but I think my only other way out is the front door. Looking at the maps and everything. But if I can kind of find a quick way to just get out, get back to my stuff. Because I believe the only way out is through the main building. Could have cameras everywhere. But maybe I find a side door to sneak through, I don't know.
right now I walked into a small office and there was like chemical fumes so I got kind of spooked I didn't get any gas alarms or anything but it's hard to hard to maintain your composure in a place like this and I believe if I went further enough down this tunnel I'd get to the main front door I'm actually gonna try this alternate exit. It's uh, 12.38. building, which is where I came in, but I came in from outside of the building. Is this where you grow the mushrooms? Getting close. It's 17. Still no lights out here. Uh -oh. These mines go on forever.
Found a side door, popped it open. There it is, fresh air, sunlight. Oh my God, a bird. <laughs> Uh, 1257 just have to go back and get my gear and get out of here